we'll get those from you, Senator uh, Johnson. We now turn to our former colleague, uh, the former Democrat member from the great state of Hawaii, uh, Congressman Gap. Thank you very much, Chairman Jordan, uh, Ranking Member Pl Plaskett, and members, aloha. Thank you for the opportunity to be here to speak, ah. to speak with you today. Benjamin Franklin said, without freedom of thought, there can be no such thing as wisdom and no such thing as public liberty without freedom of speech. What? I love our country and I cherish our God-given freedoms that are enshrined in the Constitution. Like every one of you, I took an oath, both as a, Who? a soldier and as a member of Congress to support and defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Now, I've had the privilege of serving alongside many of you in Congress for eight years, representing the people of Hawaii's 2nd Congressional District, serving on the Armed Services and Foreign Affairs Committee. I'm honored to be able to continue to serve as a Lieutenant Colonel in the U.S. Army Reserves now for almost 20 years, where during that time I deployed to three war zones and participated in multiple overseas training exercises, where I had the opportunity to see firsthand 